Threatening skies greeted the players at Oatlands. Australia Day, yes, but Japan, England and France were all looking for victory in the Bing Lee Fujitsu New South Wales Open. One of Australian golf's generation next, Minji Lee, found herself alongside Laura Davies and she'd show the veteran a thing or two in the ensuing hours. Indeed, Lee made her charge by birdieing six of the outward nine, including this at the sixth. And she would claim the honour of leading amateur, finishing equal fifth. Lindsay Wright held the overnight lead and retained it for a good while in the final round. She couldn't match Saturday's 64 though and was passed midway through the day to finish five from the lead. Canberra's Nikki Campbell began three adrift but played herself into contention by the turn with some super golf. An eagle at five and then this birdie at eight catapulted her to the top and she'd finish as one of just three to play all three rounds in the 60s. The challenges were coming from everywhere though on a frantic final day. Japan's Noriko Kubo moved into contention when she birdied the eighth as well, but then she promptly double bogeyed nine to lose momentum. No such mistake from Joe Clatton. The unflappable Frenchwoman was already four under for the day when she moved into top gear. Birdies at nine and ten and the tournament had a new contender. Nikki Campbell was running out of holes to establish a winning lead and when this one slid by at 15, her prospects dimmed further. It seemed Clatton was only warming up, playing one group behind Campbell. She had it on a string on the home stretch, this to 15. She was going to be tested somewhere and it was at the 16th where she needed to get up and down to retain the lead she'd just stolen from Campbell. As Campbell parred her way in, Clatton had a different agenda, producing her shot of the day for her second into 17, a 7-iron from 146 metres, and she was firmly closing the door on the field. <laughs> Stephanie Nars' 66 was one of the rounds of the day, and a share of second was so close to being hers. But by now, all were playing supporting roles to the rollicking clinical Clatton. How about this at 18 to give her a shot at the course record? Well, she was in no mood to miss such an opportunity. A nine under 63, and Joe Clatton took the tournament by three strokes. An impressive and popular win, and a 28, surely not her last. Uh, well, I'm extremely happy. Um, I played. Uh, I played fantastic today. I actually set myself um, a goal of shooting seven under today because I, I thought it was possible after yesterday's round. I. Because yesterday I felt like I left a couple of shots out there and uh, so it feels really good when you don't have a bogey because it feels like, because it, it basically means that every part of your game was good. So None of the locals seemed to mind that on Australia Day it was Vive la France at Oatlands. Joanna Clatton, the 2014 winner of the Bing Lee Fujitsu New South Wales Open.